thank you for attending. Uh, thank you for organization of Scalaio. Of course, it's, uh, it's a long time we didn't meet uh, or in in real life. I will present you the IO Provega. It's a connector to with the IO to uh, access Provega. So I will present what what is Provega, of course. My name is Nouguier Olivier. I'm working for Ledger. It's a company uh, in Paris. Uh, we have uh, more than ten offices in uh, Paris, Montpellier, Grenoble, London. I don't know where. Everywhere in the world. We are aim to secure your assets, your digital assets, and uh, to help you buy and exchange uh, crypto money and uh, many things. Uh, of course, we are the Sky developers, and there is some uh, position at, at, uh, at the ledger. Sorry. So ZIO, ZIO, it's a functional effect. I, I guess ma ma many of you know the, the topics, like uh, CAT or, or, or Monix or something like that. It's uh, ensure type safety, resource safety in in, in terms of uh, releasing re resource you acquire, acquired, like connection data, uh, to the database thing that exists. It's concurrent safe. Provega. It's a re reliable streaming storage, means a kind of ca Kafka, hosted on a cloud native foundation, uh, back backed by uh, dead technology, and uh, in, uh, all of this is uh, on Apache 2 essence. So what is Provega? Provega is a kind of Kafka. Uh, Kafka is a streaming uh, broker for events, uh, or more like Pulsar. If you, if you know Pulsar, it's more uh, near than to Pulsar. Globally, it's just uh, oh, there is a color not so nice. Uh, it's a streaming. It's host streams. Streams are like topics in Kafka where you can push events on from on side and consume events on on the other side. We have data sources like uh, sensors, uh, database, uh, endpoint, HTTP endpoint, and uh, on the other side you, you have uh, you have of course uh, data processors, you see? data processors, and uh, to consume your your data and makes. And it, oh sorry, it also, also exposes some key value tables, so you don't need uh, to have uh, a cluster of Redis, something like that, to, to, to store your state if you, if you want to have some state. There's also some uh, state synchronizer I'm not using yet, but I, I will. Also, it's a difference with Kafka. It's a, it's, it's a, a it's, it have a long-term storage. It means that uh, the, your events won't uh, won't disappear. They will be stored in NFS or uh, HDFS or, or S3 and or other uh, storages. That means that uh, your, you have the same data store for your streaming processing uh, and also for your batch processing. For people who are using Kafka, it's a quite nice feature. You don't have to, to pull all the data somewhere. It is done uh, out of the box. Also, uh, the streams, which are the topics, are uh, elastic, meaning that uh, this is a, a topic, a stream, and uh, the lines are partitioned. Se it's called segment in, in Propica. And uh, you can uh, configure your, your topics to scale up and down automatically, meaning that you, you say, for, for example, I, I don't want my a topic to, to accept more than don't know, uh, 1,000 events per second. If the, the rate uh, goes up, the, the topic will split automatically, and when the, the throughput uh, goes down, it will uh, merge. And as you can see, they can merge dif in different uh, way. It's not uh, the same uh, merge. So it uh, is very nice, of course, to 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 host some peak of activity. We have no no, no more issues. Or when you have Kafka, Kafka does does scale up, but does not scale down for people who know that. And uh, last point. It's quite effi still efficient with a very high number of partitions. Kafka, as far as I know, it's no more than 1,000 uh, 1, partitions for a cluster. There, you, you can have uh, 10 million of uh, partitions, meaning that that could be a data store for event sourcing, for example. Provega, from a high, high level point of view, is a, it's a, so it's a, storing a, a streaming engine with a Java API. And uh, you can use uh, some uh, classical uh, streaming uh, processor like uh, Flink, Spark, to, uh, to, uh, to, to, interact, to interact with. There is two main APIs. One API is to, to manage the resources, to create the topics, to delete them, to, to close them, to, to handle the consumer groups or reader group managers, and uh, key value tables. Which are and another API to consume the data. So that's uh, that's uh, <laughs> the aim of the project. The IO Provega, we just uh, use the Java API and hit this, uh, this uh, API. So what are we 
I will talk is how to manage the scopes, scopes are namespace, name space, the, the stream, the key value pair, and the uh, table, and the tra tra transaction, with uh, heavy use of resources, resource management of Zio, layers, streaming, and replay. Of course, I will define all, all these points. Uh, a little point, there is scope also in, in uh, the IO, so the scope of uh, Provigar are not the scope of the IO. Uh, sorry, but uh, they appear recently, I, I don't know how to name them. I mean, when I, I try to, to let the Java API in blue to, to avoid confusion. The IO, very shortly, are effects like Monix, Cat, and uh, globally, that is just value with uh, three types. So it's just description, okay? It's, it's uh, not a future, it's not running, it's just a description of a, of a receipt of a, of a processing. Globally, it consumes a resource, an environment, and it can produce a result when it works or a failure. The sometimes uh, mental, mental I, I, a more simple mental ima image is, is, is a function from R to either of E of A. Of course, it's not like implemented uh, like this, but it can uh, help to, uh, to put the idea. I didn't make the chrono. Wait, sorry. So, a very uh, hello word in uh, ZIO, it's uh, like this. It's, run it's, it's, it's runnable. You want to, to print hello world to the console. This is uh, so. This is the IO that has no requirement on the on the environment because the console is part of the, of the runtime and may throw an exception if the console is is dead and uh, doesn't produce a anything. If for any reason you don't want to point to the console, you want to, to point to, to a login, login service, you have to you you, you call this uh, this. Uh, you, you, I, I will show how it's implemented after. You write this. It produces uh, an effect that depends. On a login service and also may throw, throw an exception and uh, produce no nothing. If you want to run this, it won't run because uh, you need s this dependency and uh, you don't know how to produce it, uh, how to retrieve it. So, the mechanism I will explain after of these layers that is able to provide this dependency. And then this is a runnable uh, program. And uh, you can notice that when you provide your dependency, uh, they disappear from the event, and the ev event is uh, runnable. The connector is just uh, how to make an an a Java API into a Zio program using a, a pattern that I will uh, detail. This is the all the point I have to uh, to uh, to wrap to port into Zio. Of course, I won't uh, go through all of them. I will just take a sample of a uh, stream manager, uh, the, the tool to, the, to admi administrate the, the topics in uh, Provega. And I will show you how to create a scope using this pattern. This pattern is quite simple. In fact, it's just service definition, interfaces, traits, an implementation, a constructor to be able to produce this uh, object and some fancy uh, fancy accessor method to make this more uh, usable. So, go so starting from Java, we have, we have an interface, an interfa uh, trait, uh, sorry, an interface, it is uh, auto uh, um, creating a scope. A scope is just a namespace. It's returned a Boolean if the scope is effectively created. If it, if it already exists, it will return false. First step, we, uh, we have to define a, a Zio equivalent of this inter interface. Very easy. It's just a task that will eventually produce a Boolean. Task is just an alias, okay, from Zio to remove this uh, any because it depends on nothing. I may throw an exception, so it's uh, you can remove it's just an alias, a type, type alias. Now in, uh, the, the implementation very s straightforward. I use uh, the Java API stream manager that would be in injected soon, and I just forward the call of the of the create scope in a broken IO because it uh, has some uh, network uh, implied. Okay. So at that point, okay, uh, the last step um, show how to how, how we define my 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 class my helper helper class. Now I, I must be able to to instantiate. This class. This is done with layer, which is uh, data type of the IO. We start from the Java class, which is auto-closable, it's important. 
just wrap, wrap the Java API in uh, IO blocking. This, done, this produces uh, the IO that depends on nothing, because nothing is needed in the environment, and produces, will produce, of course, uh, every time. When, uh, when I say produces, it, it will produce a stream manager, still a Java API. Because this stream manager is auto closable, I think everybody knows what it means. It, it, it says that it's a resource that must be released because it has some connection to the network or uh, fire handle. I can add this, uh, I can uh, call this uh, combinator to produce another DIO that added a scope in the, re in the re resource. This scope is uh, the container of the finalizer of the, uh, of the, of the element of the I IO. I mean, me just mean that there is a, uh, when, the close, when the scope is closed, they will call the, the closable method of the, of the interface. After that, I just wrap my, uh, the uh, Provega screen manager into a more convenient uh, wrapper, like this. Another alias to remove the uh, scrubble. So, so at that point, I have an IO that needs a scope to, 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 to work and that will produce a live element of the manager. This is also an alias okay, uh, that uh, may throw an exception. Need a scope and uh, produces this. We just just put this in the companion object of the of the of the service with a live it's a common uh, naming and uh, just use the threads to remove the the, the interface the, the the implementation. Now I, I know how to how to create a Provega manager, but I must use it. I must say, oh, now I, I, want, I want an effect that uses this Provega Manager. Now the Provega Manager is a, is a requirement on the environment. This is a call you have to, 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 to produce. It's not really fancy because uh, the, co the compression won't help you to, to, to produce this. So there is a pattern called accessible. You should play, you should uh, please to Martin. That you just put in the companion object the call, the, uh, this call, we move, move there, move there, sorry, and then you just have to call this, uh, clear, clearly more easy to, 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 to use, the compression will help you, of, co of course. This is a program to be able to create a scope in an in, in space, sorry, in the Provega cluster. And if you try to, to run this, not if you try to compile this, you will see this very nice error at compile time, of course. That just s remind you that you depend on the uh, Provega Manager. I don't know where I can find it. So this is the error, and you just have to provide the layer shown before to uh, make this uh, uh, effect runnable. So shortly, to go from Java to Zio, there were this step acquire the, the, uh, a resource, give some finalizer to, to ensure that the resource will be uh, released uh, correctly, expose the Java co uh, calls to the uh, as a Zio effect, expose a constructor, the layer, and add the fancy accessible method. The steps C, C and E must be re re repeated for all the method of the, of, the, of, the, of the Java API, of course. And the whole sequence will, will be repeated for all the services to, and to manage the, the resources, the resource, resource group, and uh, the, the, the access to, to the data. I will now focus, of course, on this point, which, which uh, is the main point. This is, uh, so this is, this can be seen as a data source for people who use with the databases. And this is can be seen also as a result set or iterator. Okay, uh, I will connect this the, to the stream and consume, uh, consume or produce in the stream, and with tra transaction eventually. So, I have a stream, a topic. We we'll see how to define a, a reader, a source, to consume from the stream, how to produce uh, to produce in the sync in the sorry in the stream to same words. Sorry. 
and we have a table. Uh, it, it's my design. It's, it's really nice. And sorry. Also, I will, I, will, I, will, I will want to write in the in the table to consume from the read from the table and, and also to uh, to uh, to read uh, and write to the table during the flow. Okay, just just to, to, to enrich some 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 stream. I am a streaming a stream, and I, I want to, to get uh, in state in uh, stateful information. So, I, from the start, I have an empty Pravega cluster. I can create an, an namespace to put uh, something in, in, into. I will uh, call in the same way create stream to add a topic for languages. And now I want to put some 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 string in the topic. Not very hard. Zio stream will provide some uh, some uh, some uh, some uh, easy st hard coded stream for the demo. I just I will uh, instantiate a stream to con connect it to the to the uh, uh, sync. Sorry, connect it to the stream and just connect the the two and uh, yeah. will be done. From now, I will start start from the use case rather than the uh, how it's in implemented. This is uh, the whole program to write into Pravega stream. I, I have my my hard coded three string. I connect them to sync languages with some settings, of course, to 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 handle some details. Like how many uh, attempts uh, we can do before failing, and uh, of course the serializer because uh, uh, syncs only store by uh, byte uh, byte array. Also, I have a program. That depend on Pravega stream. Pravega stream must be provided as as a as a layer there. How do I implement a sync? Same pattern. I will need to retrieve a, a writer in the same way. You see the video scope, meaning that this, this writer will be released when the streaming will will finishes. When 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 there is a scope there, there is a finalizer somewhere. Okay, so again again, it's just a call to the Java API to make a, to produce a writer, add a finalizer, and uh, after I need to push event in the right right writer. It's just the important part is, is this one, <laughs> just from an event to a task. The task is just another I/O that is built from the Java API. That return a future, the I/O can easily, of course, uh, tr translate f future to 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 to, uh, to I/O, and uh, so the small detail because I can have a routing keys for for the streaming. If I have a root if you don't, I don't have a routing routing key, I, I write the event like this, or I extract the key to uh, to write. This is this produces a I/O, so an I/O that may throw an exception. That has a scope to close the writer, to to uh, to under the fin finalizer of the writer, and produces a sync. Uh, this is false. But from RIO that produces a sync. I want a sync. There is a call you have to to do, to, to, to 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 perform, which unwrap the result scoped. You see that the scope has disappeared there. That means that now the finalizer will be handled by the sync. When the sync will finished, the finalizer will be called. So I don't need any more uh, uh, a scope when, I, when I'm there. How do I write a streaming component? I acquire a writer uh, or a reader or a transactional uh, writer, map to some Zio streaming component, unwrap. To 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 retrieve the, the the sync and remove the the, the scope to ensure that the, the the all the resources will be closed. Finally. In the same vein, there is a transactional sync. That means that you can write a, 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 a sequence and the whole sequence will be pushed in the, the string or nothing. This is a non-transactional sync, and you see the difference. Just there, I'm. Cheating, okay. I have a different ra writer, of course. Ah, problem. Just in the middle, I start a transaction there. So I have still a closable writer. After I have a 
closable transaction, of course, because transaction will be closed also. And uh, this time, it's not a f uh, an, an auto finalizer because the transaction must be started. And when the I/O will be closed, depending on on the exit exit uh, of the I/O, I will abort the transaction if there was a failure and commit the transaction if there was a success. Quite uh, simple, in fact. From the other side of the of the, I need to read from Provega. Same, always the same story. In fact, I uh, acquire a reader, wi which would be closed with a finally finalizer. Sorry, it's the more or less the same to topic, même su même subject. Always wrapping in a IO. The uh, Java API should be blue. The Java API is blocking, okay? So uh, it's uh, there is timeout when, he, when the, if there is no event, the timeout the uh, the event is null. So I I, I forward uh, an empty an empty chunk. If there is an event, I, I, I forward it to to the to the stream, and there is some checkpoint that in this connector I ignore. In, in this source, I I, I will ignore. The last part are the table, the KVP table. The use case of the KVP table is there, okay? I have a tuple, I have a key value. I want to retrieve the state of the in the in the key value table. Uh, just to count. Uh, I, ju I just want to count uh, how many uh, uh, time I saw Scala in the stream. I saw it two times before. It, it arrives there. It will read the, 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 key, the key value in the key value table and uh, combine the two the two results, one and two, to make three. The code is all there. It is not important. What's important, of course, is this combination, combine function that will uh, combine the old value and the current value to produce a new value. And uh, uh, well. I acquire a table. Also, this table will be closed. So it's uh, also a pool a, a scope d a requirement in the environment. And uh, what is it? Sorry, I want to say. Um, all, the, all the point is, uh, it's just uh, here. I have the key value that arrive there, and I will try to insert them in the key value table. Insert because it's uh, an insert if there is no such value, uh, no such key, and update if there is al already uh, a value, of course. And that's it. That was very funny for me because. What uh, what do I have to do? I have to check if there is already a uh, value in the key value table. If there is already a value, I build an insert command. I uh, insert insert command. If there, is, if there is no value, sorry, sorry, I build an insert command because it's new, no value. It's Java API, sorry. And uh, if, uh, if there is already a uh, value, I have the version, which is the hash code. I don't know what is it, and I map Put a put uh, command, which, which is an update, with the version I read before, and the combine function. I don't make the, si the combine function. We just add, uh, call uh, plus, then add the, the value. I, I forget to, to, to make to show this. And what is funny is that Provega guarantees that the insert will work only if there is no uh, such value. And the update with f uh, with uh, with um, success only if if I uh, I have the read the correct version, just ending the concurrency like this. If it say fail, I just retry. Okay, just retry forever, forever. I pro probably not the best uh, strategy, but <laughs> it is work for them. I am done for the 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 the, the, the composition of, of uh, I, 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 I wrote my, my component. What was very nice with uh, the I.O. is uh, also the testing framework, which are already, of course, I.O. aware. Pro propose already PBT, uh, PBT testing, property-based testing. Of course, tests are, uh, are composable. There is a very nice mechanism uh, of shared layers for of course uh, when uh, for the, for the test i i, I need to to, uh, to 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 start a provega container and i don't want to to, to start a provega container for every every, every test it will be very, very too long there is a mechanism very simple to uh, to 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 put a, a, a layer in a, in the in the shared um, um, layer yes somewhere 
and uh, this layer will be shared by all the all the all the, all the tests, even if tests are in different files. So it's uh, very convenient. And uh, also, there are many uh, aspects. I, I won't be able to explain how uh, 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 it works. It's just aspect, like in OP, classical, classical OP, that allow you to say this sequence of tests, uh, this test must be run in seconds because there are some dependencies, or uh, this test must use live clock and not test clock that you can uh, play with. So my conviction, my my, uh, my 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 experience of the IO is really awesome. The, the, I, I know, uh, in my company, uh, people uh, made me uh, uh, an emoji. With my name is Ayo. This is Ozayo. I don't know. Zayo no. It's a, a emoji in my name because I'm I'm, uh, I'm very uh, in love with uh, with uh, the Ayo. The community community is really over welcoming. Go to, to the Discord, ask question. As always, uh, people are are very 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 kind. Um, and particularly uh, Adam Fraser, uh, uh, which is a main uh, maintainer, uh, core contributor of the IO. Developer experience is, uh, from my point of view, it's uh, unique. I, I never saw uh, anything uh, like this. What I need to do uh, still in Pravga, I must uh, I, I use, uh, find how to handle batch use case. It's, it's, it's feasible, but I didn't uh, try it, uh, time to, to, to do this yet. How to materialize something from the stream. In general, you want to, to, know, to know something, uh, how many events you read, or something like that. It's supported by, this, by, this, by the IO, but I don't know <laughs> how, how it works. Also, I had so many, 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 many more, many more uh, kind of, of connector. And uh, also, I will try to move this to the IO Connect, which is a community, uh, community, uh, community uh, uh, repository for, for connector. Some re references, document, document, of course, and uh, things like that. So I can now show you if it wants to work a little bit. Oh, it's really small. So here there is a running. And I want to show you how it works really. It's just not readable. In this window, I will just start Provega, so it's not very interesting. When it started, I will uh, reduce it. Just to wait. Whoop. Up. Uh, it's a. Uh, so I will, uh, of course, uh, try to go bigger. Tell me when it's uh, readable for everybody. Oh. Uh, is it readable from uh, all? Okay, th this is uh, the 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 creation of the resources. You can see, quite simple. I just call my my my, my accessible method. This this uh, produces. Uh, uh, no, I have to to do my, my screen. Sorry. If you look at this. I can see the type. Oh, well, sorry, oh. not easy. Uh, you you have all the, all the dependency of this uh, effect that is that need all this to work, of course. And uh, the dependencies are provided at the end of the before before running the, pr the the program. And if I want to run this, I will try to run in the. Uh, uh, so know if it work with metal, I know. Try to run this. It creates all the resources I, I wanted them to create, of course. Of course, uh, there are many, many details. Uh, when you have a key value table, you must uh, say the key value, the, the, the length of the keys are fixed. So I have a primary key with uh, one byte and a secondary primary key with uh, six 16 bytes. Some details uh, for uh, for the partition. Uh, I have a stream that will have uh, eight partition in a fixed way, and uh, nothing uh, really not noticeable there. It just works as ex expected. I have a small uh, writing demo. Okay. In this uh, in this uh, example, 
I will push uh, some data. Oh, sorry, I'm going to show you the data. It's just uh, I, I didn't take too much time. I just uh, add a thousand uh, elements of each uh, language languages. So very simply, I want to push this in in uh, in the sync. So I build a sync from from to to write in the language stream, and I just make a source of uh, of languages that is pushed in the stream. This produces a unit because I don't have any uh, any uh, any output. And uh, that's it. Uh, well that's it. Uh, so if I run this, uh, so, so it, it will write a uh, uh, thousand element of each uh, languages. After that, I write to the table to give you a table containing the value. So if if you if I want to see the um, this is a sync used to write to the table. This is a combined function. Okay, just uh, adding the old value, the, the, the current value with uh, with one in the sync. I do this in a concurrent way, as you can see, because I have to sync and the par. After that, I will read the counter to show uh, the result, which uh, which should be a thousand for each, of course. If I run this like this, I run this. Hopefully, take some time. And of course, I have uh, all the event. Uh, the count is good, I, 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 but under the hood, there are conflict because I have, uh, I have uh, two, two streams that are writing to, to, the, to the same uh, sync. Of course, sometimes probably say, "Oh, is somebody write the version you, you read before me," and uh, it's uh, hidden because it's, uh, it's casual. If I put this on a debug level, it will be chatty. Already, oh, well, it's in time. Well, if I run this, you see, bon, okay, there is not mm, all my logs. The count is still good. If, if I uh, re try to see somewhere, up, up, up. Uh, there, this was a, a, a message from the private API. Okay, I say hey, conflict, fail, and the retry policy just retry, and it's okay. It's a concurrent optimistic uh, rating, very easy to, to implement. It's just magic, the magic of IO. In fact, if I have the so I have five minutes at school, I have a more demo which is more, more just to see to, just to show how it was easy. I don't know what is this? In this uh, terminal, not important what uh, I run um, a web socket with a Zio HTTP that is connected to the stream. Uh, the two I will show the code, it's very easy. So I run the web, the web socket. This is a web socket. This is a web socket demo of uh, of Zio uh, HTTP. Uh, so nothing uh, very uh, from from me. What I want to see when the the client will connect to the web socket, it triggers this function. I will register the uh, the uh, the the socket to the channel very easily. Okay, I have a stream function and I push this in uh, in the web, web, web socket. Okay, just uh, just a forwarding uh, the event to the to the channel or channel. Yeah, that's it. And uh, if I now try to, ah, uh, you would already open. I don't know if he, if he consumes the, the stream or not. I don't know. If not, uh, this is a web socket. Okay, I just connected to, to the to the to the to the stream. It consumes all the all the data. If I want to run again the uh, the the production, see it's okay. Everything is connected. It's, just, it's nothing in, in terms of coding. Really, there is nothing more than what I show. Of course, if I close the socket, ah, it was too small. You see the the uh, channel. It's not readable yet. But sorry. Yeah, 
So the, 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 the socket was closed. I, l, 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 all the resources are freed, and, and I can re re reconnect to the socket. There will be some chatty error it's from, from Provega side, not, not from uh, if I run again the the, the run, it's okay. Uh, all resources are freed uh, every time, and um, all, the, all, all, uh, all the code has been presented. Okay, there is no uh, no. No, it's okay. I nothing. Uh, uh, just uh, to, the, to the conclusion, that it's very, 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 very fun. Very fun. The only point that uh, the pain point I, I, I have is to uh, to express the um, the accessible method. Okay. Uh, the the you remember well that it was the this part. Up, 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 up. This is the only pain point with the IO. It's this one, okay? You have to write this uh, helper method for all the methods you, you are all the, the method you, you want to access. With Scala 2, it was handled by a macro, annotation macro. But for some reason, uh, I, I asked the, the question to Scala team yesterday. He gave me the answer, and after the answer, I, I forget my question. It, it, uh, it's not yet supported because it's not totally safe, but uh, wow, wow, <laughs> okay, good reason probably, <laughs> but uh, I, it's not a, not my my level clearly. And uh, for that, um, I, I played with the Scala fix. If, if you're interested, to 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 to, to um, I don't have the time, but it's, it's, it will be fun to 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 make some Scala fix rule, rules that add add uh, that produces this uh, this uh, this helper method. Uh, uh, it's a code code modification. It's not not macro, but uh, on live, it's very fun. If if you want to see it, uh, I can show you. I'm very really proud proud of it. That's it. That's it for me. Thank you. <laughs> if you have a question, I will be happy to try to answer. Question uh, for auto closable resources: How Zayo knows how to close it? How? Uh, when? How Zayo know to close it? Uh, in how? It's uh, it's it's when uh, I guess. Oh. Uh, when when the effect will be will be finished? Yes. The auto closable will be called automatically by, by the runtime of the IO. Okay, so, so it's a co it's a it's a convention. No, 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 it's not a convention. It's a. No, it uh, I I got the when, I got the when. Yeah. But uh, the how. Ah, the how. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. No, okay, so sorry, sorry. All right, sorry. Uh, the how. It's it's uh, this uh, this call. Okay. Ah, there. <coughs> when uh, if you want to see there, it's uh, in fact it's very yeah, very I very I very. I, I, I got that. I got that. But uh, oh yeah, how Zayo know. Uh, when to close? No, no. Ah. <laughs> what to do? What to do? What to do? What to do for for, for Java? It, 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 calls, it will call the close method because it's an auto okay, So it's a convention. Uh, uh, yes, uh, by, by, by it's contract by interface because I, I am auto closable. Uh, I have the method close. Okay. It's, it's a it's the thing we use in Java uh, with try with resources. It's the same mechanism. In fact. Okay. And uh, it's. Uh, there is a. Uh, I don't um, if you want to see the, the implementation, it's very straightforward. Yeah. In fact, so auto closable have a close method. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's, 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 uh, it's, it's sorry, it's, it's Java. It's a quite common pattern in Java, and uh, and it's, it's nothing is magic. Okay, there is a. This this uh, when I have a Zio when the target when the, the result of the Zio is auto causable okay we have um, uh, NPC class so uh, extension methods that are added there with finalizer auto okay. that I call and acquire release with success closed when the Io finishes it could close okay. it's uh, quite elegant I think yes. because at this point is very inter is interesting comparing with cats. Cats, we you must use resources. 
And when in a flood map, when you in, when uh, in, flood map, in the for comparison, when you start with uh, resources, you have to have all has to be resources. There you can mix uh, resources, uh, Zio resource with Zio, without any uh, any uh, syntactic sugar to add. So I find this very convenient for a portal view. What will happen if uh, we don't call uh, final finalizer auto? Uh, you you leak your resource. It won't okay. be closed. Shouldn't we call that implicitly? Uh, because mm. it, it has scope as an environment? Yeah, so but, but, but as a user of the library, you don't have to do anything, okay? Okay. You, 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 okay, so is that not, not, so not so clear, perhaps. But as a user of the, of the API, you won't see any uh, with finalizer auto there, okay? It's, it's uh, the in, in, the in the component. Okay, uh, the, the user it just uh, do it just, just uh, well, I want to create a scope. Okay, this scope, uh, this scope need uh, 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 no scope. <laughs> I need to create this, this stream. This stream need a scope because uh, to close the, 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 the some tool, it's it, it provided by by, by by the connector. You, as a, as an end user of my connector, you don't have to to to, to handle this. Mm -hmm. It's under it's a very secure way, secure way. And for the story, when I start to to to, to play with Provega. Many resources need to be closed, uh, particularly readers. Readers, if you don't close cleanly a reader, it's it's locked. You have to to man manually uh, free the the reader. And when I when I, uh, I, I I make this, I make many mistakes, so I make some code to clean the, the, the reader with use cases. When I wrote the, the, the component, it's so 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 nice, so well code <laughs> that I I never leak the resources. And when I wanted to uh, to uh, to because the project is on GitHub, of course, it's uh, it's uh, all, uh, all, uh, all all you want in terms of, uh, of uh, Apache 2 and I don't know. And uh, as you can see, my code coverage is perfect. <laughs> and and uh, it's worked very hard to uh, to see the story, the history of the of the of the of the coverage. Uh, there, in this point, it's when I I I I, I installed um, SBT coverage. I saw it's not so good. It was very bad. Okay, I, I made a spade some weeks. And this this uh, last step was to uh, test my uh, clean, cleaning my cleaning procedure of the reader, because it's very hard <laughs> with the connector. It's impossible. To you have to to kill to kill the GVM, to to to, to leak the, the resources. In fact, so I had to make some some tweak in the in the, the public API to to leak a connector uh, express to be to to obtain the 100 percent of coverage. It's, uh, Thank you. Uh, thanks again for, for the or organizer, because uh, so cool.